All right, I watched Thelma and Louise, the Criterion Collection review, 4K. Probably was a Blu-ray for it, too, at some point that they made. But um, this was excellent. The Dolby Vision was incredible. I don't even remember what year this movie came out. Let's see. Gotta get out of sleep mode. Thelma and Louise. Wow. No. Thelma and Louise. Stupid thing. Real dumb. Okay. Let's see. It was not two that wow, they made a, a series, 2019, whatever. The point is is that it was an old show and I thought that um it was really real uh, not an old show, old movie, and it was really redone in Dolby Vision incredibly. I couldn't believe the picture I was looking at. Like the restoration job that was put into it was just it it's amazing. You see other movies that are much newer and look worse. I just watched a movie that has no relations to this. Some of all fears. They are going to have special effects and stuff like that. You think they would put some effort into it? Nothing. The whole movie was like looking at a dark cloud. You couldn't see anything. No matter what HDR mode you chose. This was in Dolby Vision and this looked incredible. I could not believe what I was looking at. And the movie was good, too, and it was two hours, and it's full of special features, even though some of them might be old. It's just one great thing after another. And I gotta say, people, if you enjoy this stuff, um, you should try, um, you should try this movie out. You can bur uh, purchase it, talking on my ass now, you can purchase it for about $35. That's what it was on e um, Best Buy. I got it as a credit. Um, you don't, they're obviously not going to buy from those morons anymore. I won't buy anything from them cash. So what you can do is you probably can go on Amazon. And if you can't find it on there, you can go on eBay. You could probably get it a lot cheaper than $35, though. I, I, but you never know. These these people that re decide to remake stuff on their own, like them and the, um, the Arrow and those kind of people, they have to make money so they have to overcharge everything i understand why they do it but it's ridiculous bye bye